Look, he goes, be a good chap, right, and wait downstairs. So I scored the nuts, and two hours later, here we are. Look, I expect he'd be down soon. Just... I mean, or not. Right, I, I mean, I once waited for him, right, for three days in the lobby of the Bangkok Hilton. <laughs> oh, go on, treat yourself, have a cashew, mate, go on. No? Suit yourself. And you see, what we're dealing with here, right, is a savage. Hmm? He's a pirate. Excuse my lack of discretion, but the geezers are slack. You do it with anything. A bloody old, old in the ozone layer, he would. Hmm? All he lives for, right, is chasing skirt and once in a blue moon, trouser. Now look, I'm not saying the man's a puff, but he's got the appetite. I mean, he'd, he'd shot the most rampant queen in Old Compton Street. And there's not just models and virgins. Oh no, no, no. Hey, seedy, right? He likes a bit of rough to vary the menu. <laughs> Endless nights have I driven him round the reeking slums as he preys on the destitute and deranged. Mm. The semi-retired proser with one ear. Mm. The innocent, unsuspecting smacker. He's not choosy. No. Apart from a brief hiatus last winter, right? He had on average three. Mm, Three different women a day for more than two decades. Now you do the maths. Hmm? And you might say, and, and he does. <laughs> What's wrong with a young-ish man getting his rocks off on a very regular basis? Well, I'll tell you. The rocks create an avalanche of agony. He's a treat him, hmm? betraying lying dog, and I've wasted the best years of my youth, right, mopping up after him. And I've had enough. I've, I've had enough of his broody, byronic bullshit. He's had every privilege known to man and pissed it up a wall as a point of principle. And... Not that he's got any, right? You hear me? Fucking take him. <laughs>